What's going on YouTube? It's Salt's Family Homestead. I've got Kenley with me. She just has woke up. Yeah, you're wanting the camera so you can try to eat it. I did have a video already filmed, but for some reason my camera put it at a different angle and yeah, it just would have been just a little bitty block that you could barely see if I actually finished it. So I decided just to scrap it and we'll do that video uh, probably next week. But what I did do was I cleaned out the chicken coop and they've already covered up their food. I've got to get back in there and uncover their food. They don't like bedding too much. But for all of those that are wanting to that are thinking about getting chickens you know check with your city if you live in like city we live out in the county so our county doesn't have any rules or regulations stuff like that but always check with your city make sure you know that they are okay with having farm animals because roosters can get loud ours is probably the loudest one around us I've got to clip all their wings that's the first thing but these are the my big chickens I believe they are cinnamon queens uh, if I'm wrong just leave a comment down below and let me know and if you know what kind they are tell me but these other six these are my babies We've got two Rhode Island Reds, two Broad Rocks, and I don't know what these other two are. These two white ones. And yeah, Kenley loves watching them. What are they doing, Kenley? What are they doing? Yeah, that's a big thing. If you ever get chickens from Trash Supply, don't rely on their uh, Little posters they have up saying that you know they're this kind of breed and that kind of breed or not breed uh sex because the two white ones were supposed to be all females yeah that's one of my white ones is a 100 percent rooster we're gonna go check on the peach trees see if we've got any peaches It's been two years since we've had a peach off this tree off either one of them they always try but i think they're still just growing right now you know right you know right you know right and i'm not seeing any peaches at all so I think these are just going to flower. Nope, we've got a peach. <laughs> ah, we actually have a peach growing. So we've got one peach for sure. Hopefully we'll have more to come. But if you're thinking about getting some chickens, you don't have to spend a whole lot of money. Uh, biggest things, get you a coop. You can either build one. They're really inexpensive to build. Uh, or you can go to the tractor supply or local feed store. I'm sure they have chicken coops. And nine times out of ten, they're really, really cheap. Want to say something? You're watching the chickens, aren't you? Yeah, she loves chickens. She hates bunny rabbits, but loves chickens.
But if you're wanting breeding chickens and you need to decide on what kind of breeds you want to breed. I know we're getting two new breeds. Uh, we're going to bring in some Brahmas and we're also going to bring in some Polish chickens. Now, Polish chickens, they're kind of like um, a silky chicken. Uh, but the difference is where silkies have different kind of feathers and stuff all over their body they have like kind of like a fro on top of their head that's all they have and then their regular feathers like your normal chickens brahmas uh the brahmas we're gonna get are actually certified brahmas so we'll keep those two breeds we'll keep in uh separate chicken tractors and and if you haven't seen a chicken tractor or you don't know how to make one uh i'm gonna make one or actually two later on and i'll take y'all along so if i make any mistakes y'all won't make the same mistakes i made and it'll help help y'all out but chicken tractors there's all kinds of different chicken tractors it's all on what what you like the best um, and there's a ton of different chicken tractor videos, but I will do my own video and show y'all how I do it because there's one chicken tractor that I absolutely love and I think it's a really good idea and it's not going to be that hard to make. Where I got the idea from was, uh, the Crocker family. If you haven't checked out the Crocker family, go check them out. They're really good people. Uh, and what he keeps his rabbit in is probably what I'm gonna do for a chicken tractor. I'm gonna make something similar to that. But all in all, they're simple to make, easy, and I think they'll do really good. So we'll, we'll put that on a video when we start to make those. Uh, another thing, if you're considering getting some chickens in your backyard, is if you're wanting for egg production, like if you're going to sell your eggs, of course you want Rhode Island Reds, Broad Rocks are really good. Um, there's all different types that lay really good eggs for egg production. Just figure out which ones you like the best. And for show quality, if you're going to sell them to be used in like 4-H competitions, get with your local school or organization that's going to do it and see what other people have used in the past that have been really big, really good quality chickens that they love. And that'll help you figure out what kind of show quality chickens you want. Most people that I've seen use silkies. Me, personally, I'm not a fan of silkies. I think they're... If Chewbacca had a chicken, it'd be a silky. That's Chewbacca's chickens. I, I've never liked silkies, but that's just my own opinion. Um, so yeah, if y'all have not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. It's always free. It helps us grow the channel and helps us keep creating content like this. If you want to see more chickens, I'm sorry that I, that my video actually screwed up. I was, I spent an hour trying to fix it to where it would work but every time I looked at it on YouTube it was like a little bitty block about that big that's one thing I hate about this camera is if you've got it off kilt just a little bit it's gonna put your even though you're holding a camera vertically or horizontally and you turn it just a little bit is that so? Is that so? 
it'll put your shooting it at a horizontal angle. One thing I hate about this camera. But she's getting fussy. I'm going to have to go lay her down, put her on, and take a nap. But if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, if you want us to do different content, just leave it in the comments down below. If you leave a comment, I... Hey, I am talking over here. And always, if you leave a comment, I will always reply to them. I may not get to it that day, but I will reply.